So we've seen how science obtains information from the past, but can it deduce the sequence of glacial and interglacial periods? The core samples are our climate witnesses for this sequence. What they cannot reveal is the reason why we see these sequences. The cause can be found in the so-called Milankovitch cycles. These are periodic regular fluctuations in the Earth's orbit around the Sun. We are now familiar with the succession of interglacial and glacial periods in geological history. This now begs the question, what are the causes for these natural climate variations? According to the well-established Milankovitch theory, astronomical fluctuations in the Earth orbit around the Sun are the cause. In order to understand the basis for this theory, let's consider Earth from space. You can see that the Earth travels in an elliptical orbit around the Sun. You can also see that the Earth axis is tilted with regard to its orbit, currently with an inclination of 23.5 degrees. Three factors are especially significant for glacial cycles. First of all, Earth axial tilt, or obliquity, with regard to its orbit. The inclination varies between 22 and 24.5 degrees in time, spans of about 41,000 years. Changes in this inclination result in regions, particularly the polar regions, receiving different amounts of energy from the Sun. You can easily comprehend this if you imagine that the height of the Sun's orbit above the horizon varies with the Earth's axial tilt. The second major factor is eccentricity. The Earth orbit around the Sun varies between an almost circular and a slightly elliptical shape. The orbital period of this variation is very long, about 100,000 years. In itself, the change in circularity of the orbit has only a very limited effect on the climate. But we'll get back to this later. The third factor is what we call precession, which is the wobble of the Earth on its own axis of rotation. The period of precession is approximately 21,000 years. You can comprehend this if you imagine a spinning top. The decisive factor for the climate is the combined effect of eccentricity and precession, such that seasons occur at different points along the orbit. For example, the beginning of spring can coincide with a point along the orbit furthest from or closest to the Sun. Altogether, the change in orbital parameters cause the incoming solar energy to be distributed differently across the Earth's surface. This is a very important driver of climate change. However, these changes only occur on timescales of several ten thousands to a few hundred thousand years.